guys Mike G with the MDG collections on hand today ladies and gentlemen New York City 24 degrees you know it's amazing how 24 degrees feels so warm after a day like we had yesterday I mean it was just to the point where as I finally said it was cold so you know you go through something like that and your body is, is just it's on another level it's, its intelligence will pick up on how much not cold 24 degrees is compared to five below 15 below 24 below so you know it's just it's just amazing how the human body is today feels very very comfortable and i still like this weather no matter what i adapt better in the cold than i do in the heat and just significantly warmer on a day like today All right, guys, let's jump on the highway and have a little fun. Just a quick video breaking down another tip and trick within this Uconnect. So let's get to it right now. All right, guys. So we're going to go right into the vehicle user guide as we've been doing. Once that screen loads, you're going to go into emergency and support. And of course, emergency procedures. And in this video if your engine was to overheat uh, if your engine overheats at the very top as you guys can see right here uh, it gives you some tips and tricks on what to do if god forbid your engine is about to overheat in any of the following situations you can reduce the potential for overheating by taking the appropriate action on the highway slow down in city traffic while stopped place the transmission in neutral but do not increase the engine idle speed so if you place your shifter in neutral if god forbid your engine is starting to overheat that will help reduce the overheating it also gives you a note here and it says there are steps that you can take to slow down an impeding overheat condition if your air conditioned ac is on turn it off the ac system adds heat to the engine cooling system and turning the AC off can help remove this heat. You can also turn the temperature control to maximum heat. The mold control to floor and the blower control to high. This allows the heater core to act as a supplement to the radiator and aids in removing heat from the engine cooling system. So these are just some tricks to help your car to 
reduce its overheating problem and if you guys have SOS right here it's kind of hard to see but uh, you should have an SOS button right here on your mirror until you can get this to go down with these tricks and get roadside assistance with this SOS button so just keep that in mind guys just a little tip and trick for the guys out there with these cars on reducing engine overheating all right guys that is going to do it for this upload give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and until next time ladies and gentlemen that's gonna be a wrap